Hey y'all. <clears throat> I'm gonna try this again. Um, uh, sorry guys. Trying not to vent to you guys because it's not really fair to y'all. Um, I'm just stressed and tired and it's done. I'm done with the whole situation. Um, anyway, happy. Excuse me, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, anyway, mm -mm. I've made a few videos and I have not put them up just for the fact of honestly, I forget. And then, um, they're technically no longer that relevant at the time that I've noticed I didn't put them up. So it's okay. Um, I can just give you like a brief what I think they were about. Um, I know I told you guys I finished my sister's diamond painting. Um, I told you guys I wasn't sure which one I was going to start, and I started, um, it's okay, it's okay. I started, um, my mother-in-law's, uh, sister's one. Um, now, with that being said, I have, um, brought out my latch hook for Christmas, because I have a lot that I need to get done for Christmas. So, I brought out my Christmas tree, tree skirt for Christmas, um because it needs to get done and it needs to get done like now so um anyway oh sorry guys um it just it's been a lot with everything going on um i'm pretty sure that you guys don't know that my mother-in-law asked me to do another diamond painting she looked at me for Christmas. It wasn't going to be. Because I have enough that I have to get done for Christmas. I have hers to get done for Christmas. I have her sisters to get done for Christmas. I have this Christmas tree skirt that has to be done actually by November. Because the day after Thanksgiving, I put up my tree. And it won't be a tree without a tree Christmas skirt. So I don't even have until Christmas. I have until November. And that's fastly, fastly approaching, and that's sad, and I want to cry, because that means I'm going to have a three-year-old. Because my daughter's born in November, and I'm going to cry, and I have a three-year-old, and it's sad, and scary, and exciting all at the exact same time. Like, I'm really upset that she's going to be, she's going to be three. I'm going to be 23 with a three-year-old and a... Uh, a one year old literally in two days I will have a 11 month old and in two days in exactly a month I will have a year old baby <laughs> so upset and he's growing so fast guys um anyway I'm trying not to cry I'm not really upset I'm upset about that I'm upset about a couple other things that's just been going on and I mean, I'm just, I don't know, I'm tired of being treated like garbage from his family, but then they want something from me, um, their favorite, you know, um, and he doesn't understand what makes me so upset about the whole thing and I don't think he probably ever really will he doesn't understand doesn't get it doesn't see the torture that they put me through and he may never and it is fine it's just irritating and um it's not his fault he's he's out there too he's being treated the exact same way so, um, just because he's the youngest one, and the other two apparently have made his mom prouder, I don't know. He's bought a house, and he took on somebody else's disabled child. If any of them I want to congratulate, it would be my boyfriend. The other one is, the first one is gay, living in a condo that he's renting, not buying, and... 
going on all these trips because he has all this money because he has no children. Woohoo. Go you. The other one is in the army or military or air force. I don't really know. I don't really actually care. And apparently his wife is the most amazing person ever. Um, she's actually really hateful and mean and so is my mother in law, so that's why they get along, I guess. Um and they're trying to name my child or their child after my child. Or close to my child's name to take out my child's, you know, uniqueness. I'm not okay with that either. Ever since she's got pregnant with this one, it's been basically just to stab me for having my son. I didn't plan on trying to have my children. I know that sounds awful. My daughter was literally a protection, didn't work baby. And my son was, well, doctor said I can't get pregnant. Here's paperwork. Or get pregnant. Doctor said I can't, you know, produce babies. Here's the paperwork. I'm not, you know, I'm not fertile. Okay. Um, he got with the wrong woman. Because I'm very, very fertile. So he got with the wrong woman. You know, we weren't. We weren't preventing him. We weren't trying. Just kind of, well, here he is. Um, but anyway, so, Yeah. Anyway, um, I want to show you guys what I've gotten done on the latch hook because I've actually brought it back out because I just I need to get it done. I really finally I start realizing I actually don't have December. I have November, the end of November, to do this, and it's fastly, fastly approaching. So um, I'll show you guys. I'm pretty sure I don't remember if you guys actually saw it before but it's not that much more done than it was so I'll show you guys alright y'all um if the video actually went up but I don't remember if it did or didn't you remember that all of this part was already done where it says Noel you're good sissy I've gotten mostly what I've worked on is this piece is up here and over here right now I'm actually in the middle of a line um, I figured I wanted to stop and let you guys know what was going on. See, I've cut it to where it's supposed to be the skirt. I'm going to have to trim just a little bit here. All the way around. And I've actually cut it into my circle. Yes, it's kind of jaggedy wob, but I figured I would cut it better once I got everything put on. Because this one has no ledger, no paperwork on it no you know this is how many goes here this is you got to do here and the problem with that is that they don't always you got to figure out because there's sometimes bleed over here and you're like does it go on to this one or this one this one or this one like it's it's oh I did not realize that this one did not have a ledger when I bought it, um, and I did not realize that this was like a 1980 version, which apparently never had ledgers. So you basically had to do what was on the canvas. Um, with it being Christmassy, really the only part I really need to worry about is this part, because this is going to be the first part that goes underneath the tree, but I don't want it to look awkward and weird like if someone goes off to the side and see something else yeah, that's there's supposed to be two hearts with leaves and see I don't even know if the leaves are right but I mean with the glory of them being leaves they don't have to look absolutely perfect thank god but you know I mean I can even see some like flaws in the in this which I don't like but, I mean, I followed it the best that I could, and I still have all of that to do. Like, I'm not even going to be able to do a full bear over here because it had to be cut in the middle. Because that's the only thing it told me was that the black line you cut up and the circle you cut out. That's all it told me. That's all. Nothing else. There was nothing. There was no paper to tell me, you know, how many goes in a line and nothing. 
so yeah, it's it's whatever. Um, I did want to show you guys what I've gotten done on the diamond painting. I had to stop for just a little bit, but um, I've gotten actually that done, and that was done in like a day and a half. So um, I'm actually kind of impressed with myself since I was kind of like getting um, burnt out. Sorry guys, I'm gonna do it that way. I was getting a little burnt out on diamond painting. I love diamond painting, don't get me wrong. But um when they have to be done, it's kinda like it burns you a little bit. Um, I'm sure most of y'all understand. Um when you're doing one for just fun, it's just like, okay, cool. It's fun. I can get it done whenever I want to get it done if I want to go off to another craft. Um, one thing I do need to start doing is my cross stitching again. I have one that is unfinished and I'm still working on um, and yeah. Oh yeah, and I got my nails done. Um, my birthday was actually yesterday. I turned 23. And, um, yeah. Was not planning on being 23 and two children, but, um, it's okay. I love my kids, and it's just, it's weird that, um, my mom was 33 when she had me, and I'm 10 years old younger than when she was a mom and I have two. Hold on y'all. Sorry guys, if I didn't turn it off y'all would hear this beep. Um I'm not even that close to it and I wasn't that close to it in that one video and you just hear this beep throughout the whole video. Um but anyway so um we went to the zoo yesterday and basically I made my birthday about my kids and um everybody I had a problem with it. They're like, you're not going to the bar? You're 23. You need a party. I'm 23 with two children. What party am I going to? The party of diapers spit up and throw? Like, what? My son is through a thing. That's why I said throw. He likes to throw his toys outside of his pen, and we don't know why. I have to pick them up every single day, at least three times a day. We don't know why. Um, but anyway, so I mean, what party? And everyone was actually, like, mad about it. They were mad that I spent my day, you know, making sure that my children had a good time, making sure that, you know, my boyfriend and my mother and my daughter's godparents had a good time. Yes, it's my birthday. Yes, it should be about me. And it was. It was about me making sure that my family had a nice day out. We hadn't been basically out for a long time because our last landlord screwed us over and didn't give back our deposit. And we didn't do anything wrong. We should have gotten our deposit back and we're suing for it. But, um... You know, we haven't really had any extra money to do anything. And I bought the zoo passes back in April and we hadn't gone. Because we have a, um, we're members at the Columbia Zoo. And um, I spend quite a bit of money to be a member all year long to be able to go whenever we want, whenever we want. And um, for us not to go was kind of like, uh, excuse you, excuse me. <laughs> you know, um, it's July and we still haven't gone. Um, we used quite a bit of our passes yesterday. We used four of them yesterday. We have twelve, so I mean we still have we're still pretty good on um, passes because most likely the next time we're gonna go is in December when my sister's here and we use two there. So um, anyway, I just wanted to let y'all know what was going on. Um, it may not even be fully what I wanted to said. I just don't want to get too long and it's already long as it is. Um, I do apologize about that. I don't know if any of y'all watched it to the end and I do appreciate you guys who do and know that um, I do, you know, I do ramble and I know I do. I know I don't mean to. I uh, just have a lot I want said and a lot I want done. I just can't get it all done in just a few couple minutes unfortunately and it's either a few couple minutes and like 30 videos or one video for like two minutes 
or two minutes, 12, 13, 15 minutes, you all know. Um, anyway, I hope y'all have a wonderful day, and I do apologize again. Um, I will keep you guys updated on how the slash hook is working, because it needs to get done, and hopefully, I'm actually close to halfway, and usually once, me, once I get too close to halfway, the rest of the way seems like it's so much easier to get through. So, hopefully it's true with this one, because it needs to be done. I don't know, I've just had, like, I've had all this energy when it first started, and I was, like, all excited. I'm like, oh my god, I got this much done already. Who knows what's going to be done, but, you know. And then I got into cross-stitching, and then diamond painting, and latch hooking kind of got put backwards. Um, and then cross-stitch did, too, after I found diamond painting. Um, I do love all three of my crafts, and I just have to get back into them. I don't know where I'm going to go with cross-stitching, cross um, latch hooking from here, I'm pretty sure. Um, I will probably end up finding another one because I am a, I've always, I can't say always, I used to be doing bracelets. Ever since I quit bracelets, I've done latch hooks, so I'm pretty sure this is not the end of the latch hooks. Um, yeah. You know, uh, I love, I love watching them come together because you're like, oh my god, I actually made a rug out of this yarn. You're like, I did that, and it's crazy. I don't, I, people don't understand when I say it like that. They're like, what's wrong with you? Something wrong with me. I, I'm proud of myself. I'm proud of what I did, and that's all that you know needs to be said and done. Well. You know, I've done all this and gotten this far. I'm not going to quit lot choking now. You know, um, I've done pretty well. And I've, I mean, I think I've done a good job with it. But um, anyway, y'all, I hope y'all have a lovely day, afternoon, whatever. Um, y'all like, subscribe, whichever comment any kind of concerns or questions or anything I don't care I'm always here uh, sorry guys I'm getting distracted now bye y'all